walking out. Musicians with the symphony orchestra are on the picket line right now. CBS 2's Mugo Odigwe joins us live. Mugo, I understand the musicians failed to reach a contract agreement with the Orchestra Association? They did, and you can see some of those musicians behind me right now. They've been out here along Michigan Avenue since 8 this morning, and they say they want the Orchestra Association to simply give them what they've earned. This is really about the future of the orchestra. Steve Lester is a double bass player with the Chicago Symphony Orchestra. He says for about a decade now, musicians with the orchestra haven't had competitive contracts. The kinds of contracts we've been able to win are, have been slipping. A big sticking point with the current contract the association is offering, pension. Musicians currently have a defined benefit plan that's guaranteed. It has to be funded. We think the association can afford that funding. They don't. They would like us to take a defined contribution where they just put in a set amount and whatever happens to that money is on you. Cynthia Ye says she's been with the orchestra for 12 years and that she signed up for the job with certain benefits in mind. And now like 12 years later to say, oh, actually, by the way, that's not going to happen. The CSO Board of Trustees released a statement saying that it would be irresponsible for the board to continue to authorize a pension program that jeopardizes the orchestra's future. Meanwhile, these musicians say they won't stop picketing until they get a better deal. We're committed. The musicians plan to be out here until 8 p.m. They hope to have three shifts of picketers daily. That is 12 hours until they have 12 hours daily. That is until they finally get that agreement that they're hoping for. Live in the loop, Mugo Adigwe, CBS 2 News.